It started out as frustration. I started to see, you know, kind of a series of national news reports. Some of them were actually parodies, like from The Onion, really kind of framing the quality of life here in a way that I knew not to be true. That led to a national article. I wrote the Forbes piece uh, really as kind of this um, more of a knee-jerk frustration than anything else. Which created quite a buzz. Yeah, I was shocked. You could tell there was this, this it kind of lit a fire under a, a large number of people. That fire became an idea. The idea was to create a place for even more ideas. It's done in phases. It uses some big fancy terms, crowdsourcing and crowdfunding and all of that. But uh, in short, uh, it's, it's an open platform to get your ideas out there. Ideas like this one. The Food Roof Project is a downtown urban agricultural farm that Urban Harvest STL uh, would like to build here in downtown St. Louis. It's really a community-based uh, agricultural platform. The Food Roof is one of the top five ideas voted on in the month of December on Rally St. Louis, a new website where locals can post their community projects. There's a lot of people out there that we think have great ideas. They're driving home from their job and it's like, oh, you know what we should do, or you know what St. Louis should do, or, but it dies there. So it's freezing out in the middle of winter, <laughs> but hopefully come summertime, this will be a beautiful growing green space, a rooftop farm. Well, I think a project like the Food Roof is gonna help put St. Louis on the map. Um, it's community projects yeah. like this that gain attention, not only locally, but also attract people to come to St. Louis and see what it's all about. It got more votes than any other of the ideas. And I think that in and of itself was pretty fascinating that, you know, it wasn't something that was, say, related to the Cardinals or related to, you know, the things that have typically defined St. Louis. It's an organic garden on a roof. Aaron Perlett and Brian Cross are marketing professionals by trade, but Rally was born out of a mutual love of all things St. Louis. I, I don't think there's any one thing besides pork sticks that makes St. Louis unique. Well, oh, most yeah. things. And the, and Prevail, which does not fit for human consumption. But, um, but I think it's the collection of these things. I'm going to skip all of the zoo and symphony and all that, because I think we all know that we, those are phenomenal. I think what makes St. Louis great is we have a vigor and, and, and a vibe and, and some, some good talent that's coming in and, and really seeing that they can make a difference. December's top five ideas, including Food Roof, are now working with Brian and Aaron to take their project to the next level. In February, St. Louisans can actually start pledging donations to these first five ideas. In this phase, projects must raise all funds in order to move forward towards completion. And it doesn't stop there. The process continues each month with new ideas. It's fun to go out and talk to the media and have a lot of people say this is a great idea, but until something is funded, and done, that's going to be the, the, the tipping point. So, so if we can get maybe a minimum entry price dollar. But for this group, and for St. Louis, it's not just about the individual projects. It's bigger than that. We're in this midst of this revitalization, and there's such an opportunity to have an impact on the change here. So uh, the people are amazing. The opportunities are great. Um, I just love that St. Louis has that energy about it and they're open to new and innovative ideas and everybody just wants to make it a better place. Rally is, is it's, it's a very optimistic, we're going to rally and win, but if you think about it, you don't rally unless you're coming from a spot where you're losing. And I think that that's what's interesting about St. Louis is we're not trying to PR our way out of a problem. We're not saying St. Louis is great, don't, don't worry about the problems over here. We're acknowledging we could be better. But there's such potential and there's such vigor and, and, and you think about people in a rally putting their hats on backwards and waving, I mean they believe and they believe that what they do affects the outcome of the game.